Hi, welcome everyone to our YouTube channel Neo Grey Organics. In this video, we will see one of the important information that is refund policy by ICR for the acceptance of the seat or for upgradation. The candidates, those who got seat in ICR, should pay 10,000 rupee as a seat acceptance fees. But if we want to withdraw the seat or not interested to join that particular course or college, then there we will withdraw the seat. And for that, whether there is a chance to refund the total fees, like that, many students are asking question. So we will see the clear explanation about that in this video. When you take your seat allotment letter, that is allotment letter published given by ICR, in that itself you can see in this line during online verification you are allotted university you may be asked to submit the documents in this line you can see that you have an option for upgradation before depositing the seat acceptance fees of 10,000 rupee on that portal so before you are giving the option for upgradation or acceptance of the seat so you need to check or think clearly whether you need for upgradation or you need for uh, acceptance of the seat so if you need for uh, upgradation you can click on the upgradation and then you need to pay this 10,000 rupee fees compulsorily if you take the seat or not take the seat but to confirm the that is the allotment that what they have given in the first round you need to pay this 10,000 rupee seat allotment fees for the refund policies it is mentioned to see on the page number 18 of that counseling brochure of pg or for phd you can look at there but another one important information with regard to the six seat acceptance fees is this 10,000 rupee seat acceptance fees will be adjusted in your total fees that are need to be paid to your allotted university at the time of physical reporting or admission for example in some universities you need to pay the fees of uh, 22,000 but uh, for the seat acceptance fees you are paying 10,000 rupees you can pay only 12,000 rupees because 10,000 rupees already you have paid for this seat acceptance fees this is the uh, refund policy rules here we can see that if a student want to cancel or withdraw the seat up to the admission of end of fourth round of the 5 pm that is what the date they have mentioned for the end of admissions for the fourth round it, they not consider the mop up round they consider only this fourth round that is up to 5 pm of 7th february 2023 so up to that date you can withdraw the seat if you withdraw the seat within that day or up to that day then you can get the refund policy but they will detect thousand rupee as a processing fees and they will refund you nine thousand rupee but if you withdraw the seat after that time they will not refund you so this only what they have mentioned here next with respect to for the request or refund thereafter refund policy of that particular university may be concerned and what that particular university take decision that is uh, somewhat final because some university does not have refund policy they will not give refund refund so that one also need to be taken care but if you need to withdraw the seat or you need to cancel the seat they have mentioned this no correspondence will be entertained by the council in this regard no correspondence means you cannot mail personally to ICR or some other uh, higher authorities or help desk like that so will not entertain this one and the refund process by the council shall commence after the completion of admission process at the universities so after the completion of all the admission process by the respective universities then only this refund process will start before that it will never start because for the last year also before uh, two months only they have got this seat acceptance fees as a refund so we have to consider this one but anyway there is a guarantee that your seat acceptance fees will be refunded only by deducting thousand rupee they will give you nine thousand rupee thank you